Welcome, audience, to episode 3 of Undertale. I've been at this- oh my god, what is this? New enemy, we got a snow drake. He flutters forth. This enemy's a little weird. You actually have to fight him first. What? You have to fight him? Snow terror. Ice problems are snow problem. So that's why you have to fight him first. Oh my god, well, okay. Next, I'm gonna get into another fight with one so I can show you how to dodge that. But... Snowdrake is assessing the crowd. Fucking, I got a subscriber during this fight. Awesome. <laughs> Not a subscriber, a follow. Awesome. <laughs> um, act Snowdrake. We're going to. Uh, so, if you don't know this audience, who, not audience, people who are watching, yeah, audience. Freaking, if you don't know this audience, I'm recording this episode through fucking OBS and streaming it. I have this announcement video. 17 of you watched it. At least when this recording is happening, 17 of you watched it. It's gonna be like five years in the future, like a million fucking views, and they're like, Adrian, you stupid! I'm not Adrian, I'm Mr. Deadman. I don't know what that was about. Anyway, back to, uh, back to the thing. Now we're gonna, we're gonna laugh at that joke he said. Oh god. And then he's pleased, he's happy. You get five gold. You go up, and there's a little fishing pole. It's a fishing rod, fixated to the ground. Sure. It's attached to the end of the photo with a weird looking monster. Call me, here's my number. You decide not to call. And we're, we're gonna put that back. I wonder if we'll ever meet that weird monster. So, as I was saying about undying. Uh oh. Uh oh. Shit's about to go down. <laughs> They're like a fucking 360. Sans! Oh my god, is that a human? It looks so familiar. Sh it shouldn't look familiar. This isn't my second playthrough. What? Oh, I think it looks familiar because it's a rock. Ow. Hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god! Is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god! Sans, I finally did it! Undying will... I'm gonna... I'll be so... Popular! 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 <laughs> human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will capture you. You will be delivered to the capital, and then... Then... I'm not sure what's next. Any case, you continue only if you're there. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye. So I'll keep an eye socket out for you. Ugh, oh, man, they're they're the the best. Oh. That was weird. Uh, maybe it's because of the second playthrough. You don't usually get that phone call. So we're gonna, we're gonna see what's... So Ice Cap struts into a view. Ice Cap. So this is what you gotta do. You gotta ignore him. <laughs> you manage to tear away your eyes from Ice Cap's hat. It looks pissed off. Hello, my hat's up here. It's like a girl trying to, like, it's like... You're not staring at my boobs. You gotta stare at my boobs. Said no girl ever. Fucking just ignore it though. Just ignore it. It's it's like fucking defeated. And he's 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 done. He can no longer fight. And you know, just that's how you dodge it to his attack. And you spare him. And you get 13 gold. Someone. <laughs> very famous royal guardsman. <laughs> not note. Not a very famous royal guardsman. Not yet a very famous world guardsman. God, I got water on my keyboard. Jesus Christ, Adrian. 
You are the most professional. I'm getting a new one though, so it's okay. Absolutely no moving. I wonder what that could mean. Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, please, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. So, for a doggo, you just gotta, you gotta try to pet doggo. Don't move an inch. And you don't move an inch. And that's how the fight works. It's teaching you a new mechanic. When there is a blue line of any sort, you don't fuck, you don't touch the blue line. I mean, come on. It's, it's not, you learn that shit in fucking kindergarten. You don't, you don't, don't move when a blue laser is passing through you. Fucking disclaimer, if you do have a blue laser, like, about to saw you in half, 007 style, you, maybe, hey, they're struggling when they get sawed in half. Maybe if they don't move, maybe, maybe they don't fucking get insta-killed. Maybe, I don't know. Something to think about. Moving. <laughs> I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. He's fucking smoking dog treats. Oh, well, then you talk to Sans here. Hey, here's something to remember. It's a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move, and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? So imagine a red stop stop signs are red. So imagine a blue stop sign instead. Does this? I feel like some other nation. Like, not in America, but somewhere else has a fucking blue stop sign. I gotta get some water. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs and yellow font. Do you like ice physics? I sure do. Just gonna walk around it. And you meet a friendly snowman. This is my quest. Hi, I'm a snowman. I want to see the world, but I can't move. Would you be so kind, Traveler? Please, take a piece of me and bring me very far away. This is the best quest in the game. It gets you the ultimate weapon. No, it doesn't, but we're nice people. We're nice people this fucking playthrough. You got a piece of snowman. So, that's one inventory slot we're never going to get back. It heals for like 40 or 20 HP. Really useful. Yeah, I'm not going to... We're not gonna eat it, cause we're nice people. We're gonna show the, we're gonna show the snowman the world. I can show you the world, snowman. <laughs> I'm stupid. Do I know that person? I don't <laughs> know who you. <laughs> of course I know who I know. I wanted to know if you knew. I know who I know as much as, as much as. I know who I know. You know? <laughs> oh ho! Speak of the devil! In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I hope you find this one quite shocking. <laughs> I would have been. Would've been yeah. <laughs> For you see, is the invisible electric ma electricity maze. When you use the walls of this maze. This orb minister, Hardy Zap. Sounds like fun because the amount of fun you'll probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, go ahead now. <sighs> Fucking idiot. Sans, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. Like, he doesn't track snow until he gets right down there. Then you get an orb. It's on my head. Dude, that's fucking skill. Balancing like a ball on your head while maneuvering through an invisible puzzle. I don't want to get shocked, so I'm not gonna... We're gonna... Incredible, you're slippery snow. You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, the next puzzle will not be easy. It's designed by my brother, Sam's. You will surely be confounded. I know I am. <laughs> Talk to Sans here. Hey, thanks. Brother seems to like having fun. By the way, where go? he's wearing? <laughs> he made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. 
He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Pfft, that's fucking cool. Let's see, we got 88 fucking monies. We're gonna talk to this guy. I don't understand why these are selling. It's perfect weather for something cold. I agree with you. I would drink Jamba Juice in this weather. Or a Dream Machine? Fucking best drink ever. I will take an ice cream. Down. Okay, so this is like golf. No god, and I am not Tiger Woods. I'm black, not Tiger Woods though. Not Tiger Woods black. I don't, I, and plus, a bunch of girls. Th that's like getting it in the sand. You don't want to get in the sand. You want to keep the ball moving too, or it melts when it's not moving. No! See, it's melting. No! No! I, I missed it. My first, uh, we're gonna talk to Sands. Let's see what he has to say. I've been thinking about selling some treats too. Fried snow, just 5G. I'll take it. I just, still down. Let's do it. Let's go. Fucking, let's do it. <laughs> oh, this guy. Oh, little dog, little doggy houses. What's this? His smell danger rating. Snow smell, snowman. White rating. Can become yellow rating. Unsuspicious smell, like a puppy, becomes blue. Fucking weird smells, fucking humans. Green rating, destroy at all cost. That hurt my brain. That hurt my brain. Ugh, I don't like that. Fucking... Checking the time. Checking the time. To make sure... I'm not going over the time. So we gotta keep the ball moving, keep the ball moving, just fucking keep the ball moving. No, not that way though. Too bad there's not like a run button. I'm gonna get in a fight and the ball's gonna... Oh my god, please. Oh my lord. No, okay, so... This is the worst minigame ever created. Oh, oh, no, but he gets it! Because he's super good. I got one fucking gold. Actually, that's a snow decahedron. That's a 20-sided snow die. I hope you're ready for... Sands, where's the puzzle? It's right there. It's on the ground. Trust me. There's no way they can get past this one. Well, let's, let's try it. Oh my lord. I see. Hey, kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Well, I see gifts <laughs> I see... I see monster. I see... I'll just... Oh, I hit X. Well, if you hit X and you walk around it... Oh, well that was easy. That's, how you, that's all you have to do, guys. What? Crosswords. Those are so easy, in my opinion. Junior Jumble is easily the hardest. What? Really? Dude, easy peasy wood switch. That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. Human, solve this dispute. I should have a word jumbles, bro. Word jumbles are so hard. Crossword puzzles? Fucking, it's easier than Sudoku. Sudoku? I meant Sudoku was easier. No, it's not. I'm not good at Sudoku. Yeah! We gotta talk to. Thanks for seeing. The junior jumble is super easy. <laughs> Ugh, oh man. Alright, a safe spot. It's a note from Papyrus. Freaking, how many minutes have I been going? The trap is designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize you aren't progressing. <laughs> Papyrus. It's an unplugged microwave. All I'm saying is say spaghetti. That's a microphone. There's a mouse in this hole, too. And there's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. Jesus. Knowing the mouse one day find a way to heat up the spaghetti fills you with determination. 
So we're gonna save. We're gonna keep going. Oh, it's not the snow platform. Okay, so we go over here, and oh my lord, <gasps> it's a dog knight. Lesser dog appears. We're going to pet him. <gasps> oh, watch out! Oh, that's how you dodge it. He's already ready, but we're gonna keep petting him. Oh, don't move! Oh, oh! Did not see that coming. We're gonna keep petting him. Oh my god. What is happening? Okay, so just. Da! Oh. You bastard. We're gonna keep petting him. Oh no! Oh, made it! We gotta keep petting him. We gotta pet him until he makes it to space. So remember, don't move on the blue one. We're gonna keep petting him. Critical pet. Dog's excitement has increased. He's overstimulated. <laughs> pet the dog now. Oh my god. We're good. You don't even pet it, it gets more excited. Plane tank up. We're gonna keep going. We're gonna go until we break this game. <laughs> Can I hear you? Far away, bark. <laughs> no. No! I can reach the dog again. You pet the lesser dog. Oh my. Do you see his tail? I just noticed the tail. Oh my god. How long will this madness go on? My thumbs are getting tired. I fucking love dogs. Okay, we're, we're, we're done. <laughs> we're done. That's fun. So you go over here, because if you go here, there's a switch. And you click it, and it undoes the trap. Make sure you're healed up. I will use a, the nice cream. Make sure you're healed up for this next part. If we go down here, you, you can see, oh, there's X. It's over by those trees. And boss fight. And it's now. What's that smell? Where's that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. Hmm. That's a weird smell. Makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you! So, we're gonna roll around. Don't, you smell like a weird puppy. Okay, and then you know, go under, and then oh god, screwed that up. Re stiff me, bruh. All right, smells like a. Actually, are you actually a little puppy? So you you go in the blue. You remember, blue doesn't hurt you. And that's how you dodge that attack. The dogs think you are a lost puppy. We're I'm gonna pet you now. Pet by another puppy. Fucking crazier things have happened. I'm joking. That's like breaking the law. And doggy, you pet doggy me. So we're gonna, we're gonna go like that, and then you don't move again, and then that's how you do that. And then we got pet dogaressa. Amazing. Fucking breaking their war. I'm destroying their fabric of reality. They don't even know. And then you get to spare them. And you get 40 gold. Dogs and pet other dogs? A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. And then there's a puzzle, so all you have to do is do that. Do that. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? 
The spaghetti. I ate it. Really? Well, you no one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will take you to the pasta fucking jar. <laughs> I'm fucking starting my fear hurting myself. Okay. So we're gonna talk to him. My brother started a sock collection recently. How oh, sad thing. Sometimes I wonder what he do. It's a cool guy taking care of him. Are you sure it's not the other way around? Ugh, God, my back. It's hurting so much. I gotta put something to... How oh, do I make my back hurt less? So this is another puzzle. It's really funny because this game's really puzzle-based and then it stops becoming puzzle-based, but then it's puzzle-based again. It's really weird. It's a lot of, there's a lot of, a lot of weird stuff. No so... way. Worry not, human. I, the great papyrus. Let's proceed. Meanwhile. So... Okay. Well. Pollution. To the O's. Okay, well, I'll turn all the X's and O's. This one can be confusing at first. If you suck and are not good at puzzles, you go like that, like that, and then like that. Fuck, that's how you do it. Thank you. Incredible. I'm impressed. Like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. You might. I'm not doing the voice because, like, it hurts. It hurts so much, but I'm, I'm gonna do it next time, don't worry. Really good at puzzles, huh? I mean... <laughs> Shut up. I totally knew what I was doing. Hey! It's the human! You're gonna love this puzzle! It was made by the great Dr. Elphys! You see, these tiles, once I throw the switch, they will begin to... Change color. Each color has a different thing. Red is impassable. You can't walk on them. Yellow tiles are electrified. They will electrocute you. No, oh, that's not good. I don't like getting... I don't like that. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you'll have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through if you like, but... If you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if you're blue tile, the yellow tile, fucking they'll zap you. It's, it's horrible. It's the worst thing ever. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide in the next tile. However, slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas do not like. Blue and purple are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Stand on all you like. How is that? Do you understand? I do, I do. This is really important because this puzzle is so hard. This is the hardest puzzle in the game. It's entirely random. When I pull the switch, it will make a puzzle that has never been seen before. Not even I know the solution. Yeah. I can memorize those colors, God. <laughs> Imagine if it was red first. That would be horrible. Oh my God, no. He just rolls away. <laughs> That's what I would do. It is different. D to fucking be fair, it is a little different. Because usually it's a little bit more up. At least when I played, when I played it. <laughs> it wasn't too bad for my brother since he started cooking lessons. Proving a lot. I bet he keeps it up. Looks like he even have something edible. Ha. <laughs> This machine pisses me off. It pisses me off a lot. Anyway. <laughs> oh my god, dog statues. Look at look at all these dog statues. Snow dog. Broke head of a snow dog. Dog will never give up trying to make perfect snow dog. Determination. Just in here, filled with inspiration. I'm trying to build snow dogs. But as it built it, I'm sorry, about the sculpture, <gasps> until it was rather sad to watch. 
bless your dog. So I didn't know this. If you keep petting the dog, if you don't pet the dog, if you pet the dog like once or twice and you stop it, he's here trying to make a snow dog. But if you keep petting him, freaking the world blows up. Anyway, I'm gonna call it for this episode. Um, thank you for watching, guys. It's 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 been nice. It's, it's going good. 70, 71 minutes. That means I've been watching this episode for like 22, 23. So, fun fact, if you keep petting the dog's head, he makes giant snow statues. If you don't, he doesn't. So, you know, if you're playing the game, don't pet the fucking dog. Unless you want to see an adorable fucking dog. Uh, or else you'll see the dog make snow statues. It's cool. Anyway, uh, thanks for, uh, thanks for coming out, guys. Uh, thanks for watching, and I hope you enjoyed it.